Okay, so today is like crazy good weather here in Iceland, so I am going to take you guys on a little trip. <laughs> We are going to a place that I feel like not that many tourists know about. I am super excited. Hopefully I can get some really, really cool pictures for my Instagram while I am there. We are going to a mountain today and the mountain is called Esjan. And I am going to show you how you can get there. Basically, you just open up Google Maps if you're in Iceland and you just type in Esjan and this is the mountain and I'm just going to start. I will talk to you guys when I'm there. I'm just gonna listen to an audiobook while I am driving. It's really freaking hot today. I think it's like 15, 16 degrees outside, which is really hot here in Iceland. So let's go. Let's do this. All right, are you guys ready? I don't think you're ready for this. So these are all of our options. I think I am going to be doing this one today. You don't have to be in like crazy shape to get up there. I'm very excited. Also, we have a restaurant right there. So this is a very tourist friendly place. This water is by the way drinkable. So if you ever get thirsty, you can drink the water here. So yeah, that's cool. This walk is not like crazy difficult, but it is really hot outside. So <laughs> it makes it a little bit more difficult. But yeah, this is just crazy beautiful. Shit, here today. Here's a lot of passion. Oh my god, I'm sweating like a pig. Jesus, I was wrong before. This is very hard. Wow. Okay, just a few things. Even though the weather is absolutely beautiful, there are not that many people here, which is very nice because I don't really like filming in front of people. <laughs> if you are in Iceland and you want to come up here, I think it's a really good idea to come up here during the week instead of the weekend. Today is Friday, it's two o'clock, so yeah, this is great. Okay, I have to show you guys these flowers. In Icelandic, these flowers are called glemere. Uh, which is forget-me-not in English. There is this thing that you do in Iceland um, where <laughs> my mom used to do this to me. Uh, you put the flower like anywhere on your clothes. So you take the flower and you put it on you and you say Glemere, glemere, glemtu mer aldrei. And the flower sticks <laughs> to your clothes. Um, Glemere, glemere, glemtu mer aldrei means basically glemere, glemere, 
forget me not. I think it's like a very cute tradition that my mom used to do to me and I think a lot of Icelandic people can relate. If you see these flowers anywhere in Iceland, then you have to say Gleimere, 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 I'm almost at the top. I honestly feel like I'm not alone because I have my camera with me and I keep speaking to my camera so it's kind of like you guys are hiking with me to be honest. I think this is all of the exercise that I am going to do today. You can see those rocks over there. Well, here in Iceland, when we are hiking, we take a rock like this one. And when we see a pile of rocks like these, you can actually make a wish. So you can make a wish and then you can put your rock on the pile. I don't know if you guys do that in your countries, but I was from Iceland and you know, mamma and kent to theater like a little bit of me vita, so that mamma means she is not a single, she is not a single, she is I have this one to go, I don't know if I'm going to the top. I'm pretty tired, you guys. There is where my car is. I have been walking for quite a while. So I'm not going to walk all the way up today, but you can definitely go like a lot further up Like you can see the pathway over there There are a lot of different like pathways that you can go like you can kind of see them all around There are like things like this all over the mountain so you don't get lost. If you just follow the color of your path then you definitely will not get lost. You can see all of the colors right before you start your hike. By the way, you are from Iceland and you will never go up the Asian. Wow! You are going to miss out. It is really fun to go up the Asian and you don't have to go up the Asian. These tiny little bridges are so cute to be honest. So we are back here. This is the way that I went up. Now kind of want to try out this one just to see if I can get like a really nice picture and a view for you guys. I've been hiking for like two hours or something. Whew, stuff that I do for YouTube. Can you see how sweaty I am? It's so hot. What the hell? I thought I lived in Iceland, not freaking Sunland. I have been at this for three hours. I'm getting kind of tired. So I am in my car right now. I am boiling. This was really fun. This was my first vlog, if you didn't know that. A couple of things that I want to mention if you are coming here 
to Iceland and you plan on going up the uh, Asia, you definitely should check the weather. You should also bring something to drink out of. Also, there is this thing that people from Iceland say. Um, you know when you walk in a store in like the US and the UK and the person behind the counter is like Hey, how are you? Uh, we don't really say that in Icelandic. We say uh, Dayin. Every time I passed someone who like knew that I was from Iceland, uh, they would say Dayin. Like <laughs> that basically means like good day. Hey, how are ya? Hope you're having a good day. So <laughs> Icelandic people have this ability to recognize other Icelandic people. So when you see someone that is obviously from here, you would say Dayin. Like it's just a very polite thing to do, especially when you're hiking. I have never ever been on a hike where I see an Icelandic person that doesn't say Dayin. Uh, so yeah, if someone says Dayin to you, you just say Dayin to them back. So that is like very polite. And you can see this a lot more from like older people but I really like this tradition so if you ever come to Iceland and you actually go up the Asia then you you could tweet me a picture or like tag me on Instagram I would like to see that I'm gonna go home I'm gonna meet my friend we're gonna have some sushi and I'm gonna take a very 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 cold shower after all of this I really want to do another vlog where I go up a, a another mountain that is called Halkafell I think that one is my favorite. My mom, my mom and I, we go up there so many times. Thank you so much for watching. And if you are in Iceland, I really hope you enjoy your stay. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys later. Bye.